Ladies and gentlemen, my name's Zips, and welcome back to Wild Frost. You know what, you think being like, fucking 273 hours in this game, you think I'd be good. But like, I keep fucking losing. I keep, I just, I just keep sucking. Because I got like a fucking unplayable setup with like, the last setup of leaders. Oh god, these leaders also look terrible. Okay, heal two to, no, this leader's really bad. I guess we could do some, like, maybe goofy smackback shenanigans. I think this is what we're going to be playing, but it's really not that good. Okay. I got, like, an actually unplayable opening with, like, my last run. It was, it was rough. And then, like, I thought out as I was about to beat in for Nook, oh. Well, I was like, oh, nice. I And then I, like, rushed to play and died. Alrighty. Anyway, well, here, I'm gonna name this leader. Far. Far Cars. Because this is the name that came to mind for some reason. I kind of want to try Bushu with this. Bushu with a smackback leader seems like it could be okay. I really... I want to build a streak in th this game more. I think I, I need just really need a turbo sweat if I want to try building a, a streak. I could also just play Snoof and it'd probably be better for this early game. Although I did Snoof last. I'm going to play Bushu. Although the <laughs> picking Bushu is not the turbo sweat mentality I need to have if I want to... If I want to. I, I, here, I, I didn't even think about that play. I just like, I wanted to play Bushu here. I mean, the setup's. God, two grouchies is. God, just give me a good leader, man. <laughs> Alright, I should. No, what I should do is I should start freezing this grouch. I should, I should be applying snow to this grouchy. Okay, um, I can set up for a, a multi-kill, we can spend this turn getting up Woodhead, I can't greed here, I'm too weak, I literally, I actually have like, no way of killing this Winter Worm, oh, but I do want to hit the Gobbling, I'm gonna do it. I do, I do have what we do have wood head out for the gobbling. Okay. We got this snowbow. I can hit the snowbow here so we can at least guarantee it dies next turn. Bushu has enough health to survive this hit. We get a nice double kill here. Oh, I'm gonna fucking <laughs> I I'm gonna say it I'm just I'm gonna say it I think snow dwellers might be the worst clan I've just can't I have all my heart shapes in this run recently has been to have been because they've just been like underperforming I I don't get it man <laughs> Why? I thought this clan was supposed to be the best. Jesus, man. Ugh. Ugh. Surprisingly, we don't have terrible money. Fuck you, Yuki. I tried to do a Yuki run. I don't... Get, get out of my deck. I don't even want to see you. I want double frozen travelers. I'm mad. Chompom with demonized feels pretty bad. I don't know. I feel like I need something. I can take Jumbo. Jumbo might be able to at least do something. With Barrage. Like, maybe we could find a way to buff Jumbo's attack. I, I'm going to take Jumbo here. I think it's the better pick. You're gonna show, and what are you showing me? 
acorn charm. We should definitely... I uh, I should put that on my leader right now. That's... Okay. That's actually kind of huge. Acorn charm is actually kind of massive. I could have taken chomp on with acorn charm. Who cares? Ooh, wait. We could play tiny taiko. I don't... No, honestly, I... Hmm... We could play Tiny Taco, but I. Uh, we do have a, we do have healing. If I saved this Acorn Charm, we could have played Tiny Taco, and it would have been glorious. <laughs> oh man, I really should have waited a second. I I'm playing like dog shit today, and when you play a dog shit, you. I I want I want to try Wallop. I kind of want to try Wallop here, because our leader is actually now with this shell and s snow. Snow one smack, but uh, it's not really a a fulfilling angle. I think I still kind of want to take Tiny Taiko. Although, we already have a unit that wants to get hit. I, I'm going to take a wall up. I think it should hopefully be okay. I want to wait a turn to play... I could. Something I never thought about doing is scrappy sorting, scrappy sorting, scrappy sorting, sorting earth berry at the very beginning. But I do want to play wallop on on when you're at four turn counter. I'm gonna start with this. I think this is still fine. Honestly, far cars can take. Far cars can take four. Far cars has a lot of health. Now our guys are on the same, on the same turn counter. I don't want this Earth Berry to stick around. I do want to snow. I do want to hit the Berry Witch though. All right, so we got a kill here. I'm pretty sure. I kind of want to Flame Water Jumbo if I'm being honest. Cause it it does set up hmm, with, then with Scrappy Sword. You can't get a double kill next turn, or you could save it, which I think is is probably gonna be a little bit better. A well, Scrappy Sword now. We're gonna Woodhead here. And then what I can do is that we can get the kill. I am starting to notice I am extremely poor. I I I need I need to be more confident in myself. I I'm losing because I another reason I I'm losing is I'm I'm just not confident. I need to say I'm good enough. I'm maybe maybe that's why. It's I need to just believe. I just need to be able. I just need to believe in myself. Wing Bear is about to get absolutely fucking walloped here. I kind of hope this isn't a wall wallop run. We wallop isn't gonna be like our carry unit this run because last I've all I'm not topping my last title with wallop. Yeah, we are extraordinarily poor. Bling bank. I could take bling bank to solve it, and I think I will. Shade sculptor for another snow stick seems pretty solid. Or I could do two bling banks and get real fucking gimmicky. Big Berry Colonel Demona. I honestly kind of would have considered Demona here if she wasn't, if she didn't get hit with the, with the debility, with the, the debit, the debit, the, never mind. <laughs> I just can't speak. Who should, uh, Colonel, uh, no, I'd rather have Big Berry actually. I think we can just get through Infernoco with just enough, like, big body units on the board. Yeah, unfortunate. Really unfortunate shop. I don't have enough to... We shouldn't be do too badly here. The best thing for us right now, I think, would be, like, a snow cake. Or, I mean, not snow cake. Would be, like, a cake charm. Then we could play Cake Charm Flame Water, which seems like it'd be really good for this run. Alright, I, with 
Since I think I have too much HP to like to really lose to really be in much danger here. We're immediately killing Mini Moko, which is nice. <laughs> which is, I, I'm I'm not doing things completely optimally, but I I don't I need to say my to say to myself I don't need to in order to win. I'm just too cool. Hopefully. Mini Moko is... Oh, I wait. I do want to get... I would really... I do really want to try... Ooh, okay. This is tough. I This turn, I really want to get Blink Bank out. I might just let Far Cards take this. Actually, I think it's okay to let Far, Tar Far Cards take this damage. It means we have to take less next turn. Let's get Jumbo in here. Then we can just start snowing and just, and just like face taking hits, face taking attacks. What's the order here? So I need Big Barry to get a kill here. I did just notice that. I want it to be like, okay, no, Wallop can take this hit. I can freeze. You move Jumbo back here. You're getting the heal with Big Berry, which I think will, which is gonna matter, I think. The biggest threat on the board right now is this Gobbler. Ooh, yikes. I should freeze the gobbler. A lot of damage. So we can let Farcars take this just so we have a guaranteed kill on the mini Moko. We have a snow sick. I should just scrappy sword instead, I think. We don't have to worry about Infernoko think. Okay, yeah, this I we have too we had too much HP to to really lose this fight. I don't I don't think this fight I should have moved Jumbo down. I don't really think this fight this fight's not losable from here, I I don't think. Just keep snowing, Gobbler. The only thing that can really threaten us anymore is the Gobbler. I will... Just to err on the side of safety, I will do this. Is there... Is there any safety that... That that's erring? That... that that's erring on, actually? No, because I always would have drawn Scrappy. Sorry. I guess this is better because I get some damage off on the G Goblin Frostinger, but... It's not a bit... Eh, it's, it's not... It's nothing to think think too I don't think you really got to think too hard about it we do need to make sure we're killing this frostinger so we can get the extra so we can get the extra money yeah we're not we're not gonna be we're not we're, you're not in any threat just just greed just greed here let blink bank coddle you let blink bank coddle you Everything's gonna be all right. So, what would be fun for this run? Honest, if we could do a line, if we, it's been a while since I've been able to do a cool smack back line. Oh wait, I don't have a unit that can, huh? Um, weird. I would like to optimize just that. I think that honestly optimizing for the for extra money might matter here, but I don't think it's very possible. I think we just let this hit go through. Sorry, sorry, Blink Bank. I my my judgment has lapsed. Oh no! Now think about it. I am kind of tired. <laughs> I am feeling kind of tired. Maybe that's why I'm underperforming. This is pretty good. Does this a crown? So you, I'm kind of down. Maybe I can think about taking Sunbell of Bell, and then we can think of like picking an op options that are that are good. Just like a lot of cards we want to play. We have three snow sticks. I actually think it's pretty good to take Sunbell of Bell here. Bell of Bell. Damn, I still don't have as much money as I hope. 
I think I want an item here instead. Mobile campfire is okay. We'll take it. Fun. Oh, why? <laughs> why does this game do this to me? I'm going to take a little berry. Maybe this can become a little berry run. Did I? No, wait, it can't become, it can become a little berry run because I already see, seen pink berry juice. And, alright, I took a little berry and it, it's guaranteed going to be useless. Just like little berry always is. Womp womp. Womp freaking womp. <laughs> I think I should be crowning mobile campfire here. I'm probably going to end up playing mobile campfire for, the, for a late game plan. Sounds pretty solid. Just buff up a lot of, just buff up a lot of units with, with it. Well, look at all these. Look at these. Look at these buffs that my you. Look at these chunky mans that these guys are becoming thanks to the mobile campfire. Ch ch chunky mans. Let's get down the biggest barrier. Bigot berry, <laughs> bigot berry. I shouldn't say that. I really, sh I should not say bigot berry. That's not good. <laughs> That's not fun. I kind of want to. Okay, how greedy is it to just let? No, it's it's actually it's not greedy enough. I need to get bling bank in here before. All right, I will. I am gonna greed here to play. I'm gonna greed here to play Bling Bink. So wait, then what's taking this Crunker? Nothing. Nothing is taking this Crunker. Uh, Teeth Charm. My arch, my arch nemesis. Alright, very... This run is gonna be carried by... This run is gonna be carried by this Bling Bink. I'm just gonna be real with you. Because Blink Bink, Blink Bink, we don't have a super, like, confident direction yet. So we're just going to be, like, relying on Blink Bink to build up money. So when we eventually, like, pivot or find, like, a, a charm we want to play, a charm or unit or item we want to play into. Uh, Scrappy Sword, the Crunker first. Then we're going to go... Then we're gonna hit Jumbo here. Get a huge multi kill. He fucking huge. I feel it's. I feel you know with Blink. Even though I took Blink Bank here, I feel my money's not as high as I thought it would be. I gotta say. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. Let me be clear. Have and Bul I was gonna say, have Bul has Bulgo ever really gotten off this game three sh shell on kill effect when he rolls his charm? I think he definitely did in the. Pa I should have just scrappy sword it. Maybe it, uh, no. There's. I don't really see a reason I shouldn't have scrappy sword. Now I just have less snow for Bulgo. This is twelve damage. Four cards has more than 12 HP, so we can take this. God, I'm just making sure. Yeah, yeah, it's 15. You're de wait, no, you're dealing 14. All right, no, yeah, yeah, you're dealing 14. Okay, uh, honestly, I can just recall Big Barry and just play Woodhead. Or maybe I should have recalled Wallop instead. Probably. Almost definitely, actually. Damn, having another... Having two snow sticks and then, like... Having two snow sticks and minus one... And minus one bell counter actually feels really sweet. Really freaking... Actually feels really sick with it. I want to see if it's possible to... I think it 
does seem like it's, it is possible to try to go for the multi-kill he multi kill here. Krunker is not dealing threatening damage anymore, so I don't need to worry. So we do this. Get the kill. Nice. And it off, end off on a little bit more money optimization. I think it's, it's definitely going to be the stop path. Pepper flag? No. I'm kind of down for the bite box. I don't have room to play bite box. It gave me three crunk crunkers, but I don't have room to play crunkers. Unfortunate. Our board is already filled up. Shroom. Hmm. Curious. Quite curious, actually. Ooh, what do I want to do with that? I kind of honestly... So, the idea with Shroom Charm, with how you want to play it, you really want to give it to a unit with Frenzy. So, it can stack that poison quicker. Because applying one poison at a time doesn't really do anything. But if you even just a little bit of frenzy, and it's pretty good. It turns that one poison it it turns that one poison damage into three poison, or it, it turns that one poison into it turns that one da damage, one effective damage of poison into three damage of effective poison with just one stack, and then it just gets higher and higher. Okay, I think I will. And it does just feel nice in the short term. Now, I'm just... I think I will hold out on it a little bit. I don't think I need it. I should... I need to stay with... Say on, like, the idea that, like, you don't... If you don't need to add something to the deck, you probably just shouldn't. This is a fight where I think I'm going to be reliant on Wallop for... I'm going to be quite reliant on Wallop here. I, the pro we have the problem. We kill everything in this fight fairly decently, except for Wooly Drek. <laughs> Wooly Drek, we, we struggle to do big damage to one target. <laughs> Can get Big Berry down. We're killing the big feet head. So you can kill the... I think I'm just gonna let this turn play through. Hmm... I'm gonna freeze you, I think. There's probably like a lot of- Oh, sweet! <laughs> Hell yeah! Give me that money, bitch. Money, money, please. You move mobile campfire down. Mobile. That's not a word. I just said fucking word. Just said fucking gibberish. I need a freeze Bigfoot. Fortunately, it seems like one of my units are gonna have to eat this demon eyes, which is a little sad. Not much I can do. I probably should have let Wolf eat it. Yeah, I think I definitely should. I it also meant I could have killed. Also meant I could have killed. Killed that. What am I trying to say? Um, maybe I actually do this down here and then. I can do it like this if I really want to try. I think I need to kill this Bigfoot because Bigfoot being in the same lane as as Big Lou is pretty scary. So I'm kind. Of, I feel like I'm kind of. I feel like I'm kind of lost with a lot of these with a lot of these with a lot of these turns. When I don't have my snow sticks, I'm kind of at a loss for what I want to do. 
of how of how I want to further my plays. I think I need to do something like this. I need to make sure I can set the wood head up to die. Hmm. Quite problematic, I must say. I think I need to freeze a Bigfoot. I'm gonna let Big Barry take this damage. It is really scary though. I need to freeze this Bigfoot. It's he has he has ran. Oh wait, the other Bigfoot is attacking too. Man, this is oof rough. I mobile campfire has to die here, or I just recall it like a sane person. God damn, man! Oh, really fucking battle. This just got really fucking bad, man. All I can really do here is recall my units. Uh, yeah, I do feel, I feel... Oh, I am, I am feeling very, oh god, that's really bad. Can I actually end this fight? Okay, I can kill the Bigfoot up top, which is pretty solid. I do need, I think I, okay, wait, I can gunk, let's gunk for it instead, so we can save these snow sticks. So, you're not threatening, Papa. We can get wallop down. Oof, man, this, this is getting really freaking tense, really freaking tense. Alrighty. The order goes like this. You play Woodhead. Play Count Wood. Woodster. Freeze Bigfoot. I could just try to gun it for the kill on Gromble. I have enough money so I can... Or do I slow play this? I probably actually do get, get away better if, it, if I slow play. So we're gonna kill this Bigfoot. The Pawpaw's a little threatening because I feel there there might be a situation where I like be put in The thing I'm worried about is that if I'm put into a checkmate scenario with this Pawpaw. Where like my my leader is forced to attack is forced to attack into it. Can I get the kill here if I... I think I... Alright, no, we're gonna be fine here. Gonna hit Big Lutha Scrappy Sword, and then... And then, we're gonna Snow Stick. Yeah. So then you Snow Stick. And I'm pretty... Wallop gets the kill here. Exactly enough to get the kill. Sweet. Alright, good. Very scary there. That got that got quite out of hand. I definitely want to see if we can let's see if we can high roll on this charm merchant. Moku charm berry blade. Moku totem. You know, I still do have this bear, this little berry sitting around, and I think berry blade is a pretty solid pick because we have a lot of situations where we want to play cards. I think Heart Charm is a pretty damn good charm, so I'm just going to take it. Nothing else there fascinates me very much. There's another Berry Blade. I don't think it's right. Let's just see if we can get some good charms here. Frenzy Charm? Hmm... 
Roll another charm. Lumen ring. Okay. I see an angle. I see an angle we can play into. I see an idea. What my idea is, is poison, maybe we can try poison stacking, we can try a poison stacking jumbo build. So we can play shroom charm on jumbo, we could play, now is that good? Hmm, I think it's, it's okay. I feel like we really just need, like, a piece of Frenzy to make it, like, really good. So, at minimum, we're dealing four damage. And we're dealing, f we're applying four poison. So, we can crown Lumen Vase here. After a while, I think the poison definitely can stack up. If, especially, I think this is, I think this is gonna be, I think this is gonna be the correct angle. I think this is right. This HP charm, I could just give it to the leader. I could also give it the wallop. I think wallop in this run is probably outclassed by Big Barry. I still would like to keep wallop in the build. But I'm going to give this HP to Big Barry, I think. So Big Barry is like our secondary tank. Then to this, I don't really have anything I want to give that to. But we can definitely find something good. Okay. It's a neat angle. It's a rather it's a rather interesting angle. What time is it? It's almost two in the morning. Oh man. And I'm not even close to being done with Okay. Let's just let's play. All right, get down here, bling bank. Definitely need to freeze the shrudels, or else if you don't freeze the shrudels, you just kind of die on the spot. We're killing the sh we are killing the shrudels, which is to know. I would like to try stacking a lot of snow. Ooh, shroom gobbler! Ooh, yikes! Shroom gobbler is gonna really stack quickly. Ooh, this. This board looks really bad, actually. I think I need to kill. I need to kill this puffball. That's what I need to do. That's the truth. I, I absolutely, yeah, absolutely. You just need to kill the puffball there. Trying, trying to play there with the puffball is just, it's just way too threatening. Oh god, maybe the thing that's actually threatening is the Shroom Gobbler. The thing that's actually threatening is the Shroom Gobbler, and I just haven't realized it yet. I'm gonna freeze him. I'm gonna ice him. Oh, yikes. Okay. We need, to, we need to keep the poison stacking going, I think. Oh god, they're so big. It's so big, man. So fucking big. Okay. Uh hmm. Can move mobile campfire up so shroom so Big Barry gets the kill. Glad I noticed that. I can get wallop down. Do I need a berry blade anything this turn? I can berry blade. Berry Blade the Goblin doesn't really do much. Uh, it, I can set up. I can Berry Blade it to set the, him up to die. I do... Honestly, I think I'd rather sacrifice mo Mobile Campfire. Er... No, I think actually what I'd rather... What, what I would actually rather do is play... Is... Ooh, wait. What am I doing? Oh man, yeah, it's 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 rough tonight, man. It's really rough. So we're taking eight truffles, are dealing eight to my leader. Okay, it's actually not that bad. I could snow, but I need to save the snow for the gobbler, because the gobbler's gonna gobbler's just scaling up like crazy. 
My leader can take the eight. Leader goes down to three. It's all right. Because it's all right. Murder. I'm going to hit the gobbler. Now the gobbler always dies before it can attack again. Then I just apply some... Then I just apply snow to Truffle, and then we, we're we gonna be able to just walk out of this fight for free. Well, it's good, not for free, but from here, we're not gonna have any more problems. Hopefully. Hopefully no more problems. Another charm that would actually go incredibly well with this build. With this neat build. Um. Huh. I'll just sack it. Huh. This. I guess I just do this. I won't be able to get a good multi kill here, but it's fine. Truffle, it is just you now. How does it feel? Die. Die. Okay, good. Get out of there. Hmm. Okay. I have a weird idea. A really, really strange idea. And it's Smackback Charm. So what we need in this build is that we need a way to s that Jumbo can stack poison quicker. I think Smackback Charm seems like that answer, honestly. I think Smackback Charm is that answer. So with with this with those setup I'm um we're I'm looking at here, I'm gonna need to play my crown. I'm gonna need to do my crowns differently. Draw. I think cause, um, cause this idea seems risky. So what I'm gonna do? Uh oh wow uh, oh wow we're gonna str we're gonna struggle here, man. We're really gonna struggle. <laughs> man, why can't he just? I take the fucking smackback unit and I take everything that's bad against smackback. Ugh. Story of my goddamn life. Maybe I should have taken the treasure there, actually. I think I should have definitely taken the treasure so you could have found something good for Frenzy Charm. Oh, I'm crying. Okay. I'm going to play this. And we're going to hope for the best. God, crabs are going to mess my face up. Real, real bad. Oh no, and the gunk fruits. The fucking gunk. Oh no. Okay, we are killing. I mean, maybe it's not as bad as I actually am making it out to be. It's just kind of. We don't have a unit that can take bursters, but we are one shotting. You do one shot crabs. Well, technically one shot. Oh, I should have moved mobile campfire up. My bad. Yeah, that could have been a kill. Oof. Annoying. And I need to spend a I need to spend a freeze on you. Okay, crawler. All I'm asking is that you do not Crawler, what I'm i I'm crawler, I'm kindly asking that you don't give block to this that you don't give block to this burster. Fuck. <laughs> Oh no, okay. I can't, and I can't play, and I can't play wall up here to take Burster. Or else you're gonna catch, or else you're gonna catch yourself in a trap. It has to be. <sighs> Blank Bank, I can sacrifice you. I like money. The trap here is that, so I was thinking in my, oh my god, stop. 
So the trap here it, that you fall into if you're not careful is that you you let Wallop take the hit and like, oh, I'm just gonna re- I forgot about the crabber. We need a, we need this man to just stay the fuck. We need this man to stay down. Oh, and I once again didn't move up. Oh my god, I'm actually throw. I'm throwing. Okay, uh, fine. Just fucking do this. Do this shit. We play Woodhead. You likely draw into. Okay, yeah, you do. We should be fine now. You freeze crab. Car cars is still fine. Oh god. This shit's scary, man. This run has been hard. It's been hard out here for us dweller for us dwellers of the snow. Alright. We're gonna put now the unfortunately the thing with this setup I wanna try doing this poison this poison stacking setup is that is that we can't we won't be able to use mobile campfire because mobile campfire is just gonna get fucked. Jumbo is just gonna fuck this campfire and <laughs> suffer horrific burns and suffer horrific burns because of it. Oh god, I'm sorry, Jumbo. <laughs> Oh god. That is not cool. Ooh, nice. Removal. Great. I was worried about these gun fruits. Now I'm not. Because they're gone. Sweet. Hmm. Let's just look at what charms we're seeing here. It's always a crown. Take this. Oh, that would have been so... Okay, wait a second. Um... Hmm. You know what's kind of cute you can do here? Let me show you. So now you can do this... But then, you have a free-to-play 3 snow, 3 damage card. Which I think is kind of cute. Now, do I take Numlin here or do I take another charm? I think there's a lot of good targets for Numlin. Especially, yeah, I'm going to take Numlin here. Especially with... Sun Bell of the Bell, I think it's definitely right. Now, what am I crowning here? You can't really crown Wallop. Unfortunately, I'm actually, like, lacking a, a good option to crown here. I guess I could crown Flame Water, which is kind of sad. No, I'm going to crown Sunrod. That's what I want to crown. Sunrod means Jumbo gets to attack quicker. All right. So something I do need to do. I'll draw. I definitely gotta draw snow here. Heck, I drew. No, oh, fuck you, Ice Forge. I'm doing this because I wanted to take. I was like, I was like, dang, I wanted to take a screenshot here, but I don't want Jumbo to have minus one for the photo. So I'm actually, I'm literally just gonna wait. But I then I should also move Mobile Campfire down. Yeah, there you go. That's the good. I have a good and I've thought of a good name. It's also good because I've, th I've thought of what I want to name this this episode. I thought of I thought of a nice cute name. Let's get wop. Let's get wallop. Wallop. Okay. We can you can just snow plum. It seems okay. 
Snowing Plum means Wallop can get the kill. Oh, God. Oh, shoot. No, oh, that's not cool. Wallop, I think you're going to be fine. Here, we're just going to... be. In this situation, we're just going to snow. We're just going to Noomlin snow stick. It would be really fucked up if I if I was on the final fight and I somehow did not draw did not draw did don't draw a setup that allows me to play. Oh wait, you don't have snow. Fuck. Ah, oh, falls. I'm so no. Yes, I have uh, far cars. Far cars is here to help. Far cars is here to save the day. Can kill the Bigfoot with. You can kill and heal up with Berry Blade, which is very nice. Alright, unfortunately, I do have to eat... I need to freeze Frost Guardian here. God, I keep forgetting to move Mobile Campfire up, and it's... It's killing me, man. How am I... Okay, no, I see how you don't die. You move Big Berry down, then you Sunrock Big Berry. It's it's rather simple, actually. Alright, yeah, you're good now. You you are gonna be fine. You just play Woodhead. Alright, sweet. Looked a little scary there, but you, man but you manage. Noomlin, I think I actually want to save this... I think I actually want to save this Noomlin. I really should I need to keep moving I need I keep forgetting to move units in front of this campfire oh man <laughs> okay mm. I, I okay I, I was thinking about like what I'm gonna title this video I've mentioned how I come up so I want to title this video jumbo cooks poison stew now I was thinking if you guys haven't been around if you guys don't know my friend cranberry he streams and makes a it makes very good content he, a joke that's been going, a joke that's been, I should have, there's no reason, I, you know, I saved that, you know, I did, I was like, alright, I'm gonna save this, I was thinking like, hey, alright, I'm gonna save this here, this here card, this here item, or this, the Noomlin snow stick, so I could, so I could snow stick something this turn. Then I just re draw past it. Curious. You are all alone, Frost Guardian. This is this is what your choice. This is the Oh wait. Okay, I need to see if we can set up for the one hit wonder kill here, now thinking about it. Let's just whittle him down. Okay, five, four, brings you down to nine. I can't let Jumbo attack, so I need to recall Jumbo. Or else you lose it. I can, so this is five, two, five, seven, 11. You found it. You found it. We did it. We found once again, once again, ladies and gentlemen, we get the we get the one hit wonder achievement on this save file. Everybody fucking clap. Everybody give clap clap your hands. I love doing that. Alright. Sweet. All right, let's see if this weird idea I came up with can work. <laughs> so you need to fit Jumbo down here. Play you. Give love to you. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna recall so, uh, something I'm kind of noticing that might be a problem is that Frost Jailer is dealing a lot of damage. 
Oh, wait. No, I should have not actually played that. I didn't want... I really did not want to give Frost Junker any attack. <laughs> okay. This strategy is also scary because your leader is in, is in Frost Bomber lane, but... Um... I don't know. I'm going to freeze Frost Jailer. I feel like you might catch you might you might end up catching yourself in a trap if you don't. Okay. Play this. Frost Bomber attacks which isn't really isn't a big deal. All right. Poison is stacking. However, um oh why are you applying one no you fucking asshole <laughs> you motherfucker oh come on come on man not cool that is not cool that is very fucking lame oh god i have to like spend so much snow on to Wait, I could have just killed Frostland, Frost Lancer. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, Frost Crusher gets does not get out an attack. Oh, but Big Berry is dead. The balls. <laughs> oh crap. Okay, Big Berry, this is, I'm very glad to put Health Charm on, that we put Health Charm, so Big Berry can survive one more turn here. Alright, we should be in a winning angle now. We've a limit, okay, yeah, we should. Now we just need a stack poison. Until we eventually get the kill. I would like... Okay, what I want to do here... Is... This? Yeah, okay, this is really good. What I need to do here is that I need to Snow Stick Frost Bomber. Then Jumbo gets a ton of Smackback. Alright, right at the tail end of this run, Smackback Charm pulls through it as... As the carry, as the carry charm that it was always meant to be. Hell yeah! It was like this run was. This was a. This was a tricky. This run felt like a. This was a tricky one. I, you, I feel like you definitely. I kind of had to do something I. I don't normally do. Normally, my. I feel like my playstyle is like pick frail unit that you just buff up a bunch. Here, I had to do. I had to play different. I had I saw Tiny Taiko. I I think this run could still work if you. I think Tiny Taiko is another angle you could have played this run in. But Jumbo did work out. Got really was really was very touch rather touch and go there. All right, sweet. This is what we're playing next time. This leader is pretty solid. This leader is okay. This leader, eh, if this was one extra overburn, I think it'd be better. This leader is okay. Very okay set of leaders. Anyway, that's going to do for this episode of Wild Frost. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to like and or comment and or subscribe. While you're at it, share this video for your best friend or greatest enemy. I'll catch you guys later.